Well, 14 goals scored by Everton in their four matches played in all competitions this season. Their last two visits here, though, have both finished goalless. Well, the way Everton have started the campaign, you wouldn't put money on that happening again today. Here's Keate. Jordan Ayew. Townsend puts one into the danger zone and off the head of Yeri Mina. It looped up kindly, really, for Jordan Pickford. No real issues for the Everton keeper there. Rodriguez for Keane into Palace territory. Allowed to venture. Swings one wide. Rodriguez with the cutback, Decore trying to turn and get a shot in, he did. It was tame in the end, but straight at the goalkeeper. Good work by Everton, that. Michael Keane ventured a fair distance forward. Gomez. Coleman's got there. Decore for Rodriguez, that's a great ball in for Coleman, Seamus Coleman, Dominic Calvert-Lewin, yes, again for Everton, brilliant football, Hammers Rodriguez, Seamus Coleman, Dominic Calvert-Lewin, goal, what else from him, five for the season, Everton in front, inside ten minutes. Calvert-Lewin, five in the opening three games, including this, in terms of Premier League football. Left footer done deep and in, headed home by Czech Cuarte, who escaped Everton Marcus inside the penalty area and powered a header behind Jordan Pickford. James Rodriguez has released Richarlison, Richarlison, can he get a run on goal? Palace have got men back, Richarlison gets past Townsend and onto his right foot, Townsend recovers and Richarlison eventually has to settle for just the corner but there are appeals for handball. The video assistant referee will have a look at this and check for a possible penalty. This should be going Everton's way. No. A corner is the verdict. No penalty, no handball by Joel Ward. Well, file that one in the category of seen them given. Coleman plots it into the path of Hamas Rodriguez. Who can he pick out here? Onto Luca Dean's head and again appeals for handball. Checking a possible penalty appeal here. Again, it's Joel Ward involved. This time it's his left hand. Well, he got away with one earlier. Is he going to get away with this one? It's a penalty for Everton. It is a penalty for Everton. Joel Ward, you haven't got away with it this time. Everton have. A spot kick. Richarlison to open his Premier League account for the season and put Everton in front again here. It's a short run off and he batters it home. Great penalty from Richarlison. He stuttered, stopped and then blasted it home to give the Palace keeper no chance. Richarlison's got his first Premier League goal of the season. Everton are 2-1 up at Crystal Palace. Given away by Duarte that time. Here's James Rodriguez. Oh, he's tripped just outside the penalty area. He was shaping to shoot there. MacArthur will get a yellow card. This could be a South American speciality. Rodriguez, in the end, straight into the goalkeeper's arms. No real pace on it from Rodriguez. 
And that is half-time at Selhurst Park. It's Crystal Palace 1, Everton 2. So, Palace to get this second half underway here at Selhurst Park. Everton are aiming for successive league wins in London for the first time in five years. Luca Dean wins Everton a corner, first of the second half. Rodriguez swings it in. Oh, that was a big chance for Calvert-Lewin. Just got his feet wrong there, really. Now Richarlison. Can he get the better of Ward? He's having a go. Luca Dean's gone ahead of him, but across comes Kiarte. He's going to see that behind for the goal kick. Luca Dean claims the defender got a touch on it. Kevin Friend points to the corner quadrants. And James Rodriguez to take for Everton. Rodriguez with the delivery. And there's the header, Calvert-Lewin. And Michael Keane might have just got in each other's way there. There's another one that goes down as a chance for Everton from that Rodriguez corner. And now there's defending to do with Wilfred Zahar on the counter-attack. And Everton have taken care of that. It's a wet one now at Palace. This was the chance where Calvert-Lewin and Keane both went for the same ball. Ward plays it forward this time. Gary Mina deemed to have fouled Jordan Ayew. Free kick Palace. Not sure what Yeri Mina could have done here. Sacco forward, Piate forward. Townsend goes deep to the far post and it's put behind. They're claiming a corner. Piate wants a corner. Not going to get it. Sent very deep again by Townsend. And check Piate. Saw it into the side netting. Didn't look like there was a touch off an Everton player last. Seamus Coleman now. Joel Ward is there in front of Richarlison. Here is the Brazilian though playing it in for Lucas Dean. Lucas Dean's ball in. Rodriguez on the volley and behind for the corner for Everton. You fancied him there, didn't you? James Rodriguez from this Luca Dean delivery, and just in the way. Crystal Palace managed to defend it, just that block. Richarlison. Richarlison. Sigurdsson wants it. Might break for Calvert-Lewin, it does. Just didn't get enough loft to beat the goalkeeper. Free kick for the foul on Zahar, and Palace just want to get on with it. Just three minutes of the 90 to play. Gary Mina to try and defend, and Pickford will smother. That's good enough for Everton at the moment, that. It's played three, one three. Everton, top of the Premier League. The 100% record continues. Everton are on fire at the moment. That man in particular, Dominic Calvert-Lewin, has five for the season. It's finished at Selhurst Park. Crystal Palace yeah. one. Everton 2. Yeah,